Harry Sun Moon Horizon sign. Okay, welcome. This is the energy vibration reading for um the second week in December 2018. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration. Okay, whatever is transpiring and happening, Aries, I'm seeing some sadness coming out. You got to let go of the situation. Whatever is coming up, you Aries, I see some sadness coming up and you got to let go of the situations, okay? So whatever is happening in the life of you, Aries, in this week, week beginning 9th until the 15th, you got to let it go because I'm seeing some sadness that is coming up. You need to realize that a situation has to come to an end and you got to let it go. I'm seeing some of you Aries an offer is going to be coming in. But um, for some of you Aries, you want a new start. I'm seeing you trying to build on something new. So I'm seeing for some of you a new start is coming in. Whatever the situation is, I'm seeing some of you have some regrets um, with a family situation. Um, or regrets with an Aquarius and a Scorpion and a Taurus. So this is coming up because whatever the issue is and the situation is, Aries, I'm seeing this energy. Now it's about working together. Whatever is transpiring, you Aries, is about working together. This can have to affect the Christmas season. But what I'm seeing for you, Aries, is that some of you could be receiving an offer, especially the people for the five years and older i'm seeing some of you um but i'm seeing sadness for some of you and you need to let go of a situation okay i'm seeing sadness for some of you aries and you need to let go of a situation so let's see what is coming out with this eight of cups i'm seeing sadness some of you aries are dealing with a, a taurus virgo or capricorn and i see some sadness because this person is walking away from you and this person is leaving whatever the issue is and the situation is with the sadness i see this person do not want to collaborate with you and is walking away who oh, uh, you aries men came up and i'm seeing the end of a situation an end of a situation that was deceptive you have created the situation for a taurus virgo or a capcorn woman and i'm seeing the situation is coming to an end there is some sadness and there's some regrets i'm seeing you receiving news from a scorpion whoever the scorpion is but there is some sadness and <clears throat> and some regret this could be a child <clears throat> um as some of you aries could be receiving um information from some of you had hope that uh, some connection between you and a taurus virgo and capricorn would have worked out but um as you realize it didn't work out some of you um your marriage um some of you want to heal your marriage but i see your partner decide to move away okay so some of you wanted to uh heal your marriage but i see that your uh, partner decide to uh, to move away and it has to do with the men 45 years and older because they found out of some deceptiveness about money that has transpired so some of you could be married to a cancer whoever this cancer is you wanted to work out a situation with this cancer but this cancer decide no more whatever the issue is i see that um this cancer is decided no i no longer want to work out this situation the truth came out over some deceptive things that you um um for some of you the truth came out over a scorpion whatever that has happened and transpired with a scorpion the truth came out okay there are deceptiveness about money and i see that some of you have to pay back um a taurus virgo or capricorn a whole lot of money because they have found out what you have um, um done some of you had pay um some money to uh, deceive someone um, whatever that has transpired, I see some of you have paid some money to an organization. You have paid a Taurus in an organization to deceive someone. This person could be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, and now they're giving you up. Okay, so it was as if you um, guys did something. The truth is coming out. An organization is seeing the truth of what you have done to a taurus virgo or a capricorn some of you could have wanted to work with a taurus virgo or a capricorn and they're saying no they don't want to be in the same alignment of energies with you 
whatever has transpired and whatever has happened they do not want to be in the same alliance as with you whatever is happening I'm seeing that some of you have some regrets a whole lot of regrets about a whole lot of money and uh, whatever the regrets is I, I, I see that you're trying to give love to someone but I see this person is turning their backs on you so whatever that has transpired there's a lot of conflicts um, a lot of conflicts and a lot of burdens for some of you Aries whatever has transpired I'm seeing a, a whole lot of truth is coming out a whole lot of truth is coming out What was it? The borrow jota? Borrow jota. So Aries, um, whatever the issue is and the situation is for you, Aries, what I'm seeing is that um, there, there, there was some deceptive situation at play. Whatever and however this deceptive situation had come up, um, um, Aries, uh, I'm seeing that there was some deceptive situation at play. But um, some of you who um, wanted to connect with um, this, uh, if you were Aries that is um, um, married to a Taurus um, or a Virgo, I'm seeing that this Taurus and Virgo is ending the relationship because I'm seeing, I'm seeing new love is coming in, and I see that whatever you had had with this um, Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, I'm seeing they don't want to, you know, because some of you were in love with them, some of you had worked with them. I'm seeing this person finding out the secret of what has transpired and they're like uh, turning their backs to you because you can see that her back is being turned to you and they don't want to have anything to do with you. So you men four to five years and older, if you were married to a Taurus, Virgo or a Capricorn, I'm seeing that they are turning their backs on you and I see that you have to pay them back some money. There is a lot of, uh, um, um, there, there, there is a lot of, uh, sadness because some of you whatever has transpired between money between you and a taurus and a virgo it's all coming out okay so let's see the sadness the sadness is around a situation some of you um this could be someone who you did business with or someone who you work with or whatever but i'm seeing some regrets that you have um because whatever has transpired an organization i've seen some deceptiveness at play with money um for some of you okay for some of you so i'm seeing some of you have some sadness i see that you have to pay back um a taurus virgo a capricorn or a virgo have found out something that you have done and a taurus okay when we look at the magician I am seeing that some situation with an organization is going to be coming out. And I'm seeing that some um, 
whoever that you and connect with, I think they're seeing the truth about a situation with an organization and what exactly has transpired. Because the magician is here and it's like, um, it's a go with the organization because they're seeing something that has transpired. And I think that a Taurus um, who has a company or so is seeing exactly what has transpired, okay? Some of you are dealing with a cancer. Some of you, um, your partner is walking away from you and it has to do um, with money. The truth is coming out about you young Aries, whatever the issue is in the situation. I'm seeing that you young Aries that is in a relationship, your partner or your family, have found out some deceptiveness and some lies that has transpired. And it has to do with you young Aries between the age of 18 and 45. Five. I'm seeing some of you want a new start with um it could be a Pisces so but I'm not seeing this new start coming in because there are situation that has to do with money that is affecting your relationship now whatever the secret there was and whatever has transpired um I'm seeing that you men there is not a new chance because there was some lies and deceptiveness in um your you, you men who are married, I'm seeing that your wife, your wife has found out about some secrets of yours and some lies and deceptiveness of yours. So some of you um, want to reconnect with um, um, a scorpion. The scorpion could be a family mem a member. You want to offer the scorpion um, love, but I, I, I don't think that this is going to be happening because I'm seeing this at Christmas time that some of you as parents want to offer it's like you're asking your kids to come over and some of you um they will but some of you is as if uh, no especially you men um your kids don't want to come over and they don't want to celebrate because they found out uh, um some deceptive moves so you men are worried you men are worried there was an issue you're going to be receiving news from um a aquarian and this aquarian um, could be connected with you whether it's your children or it's a young Aquarian you're going to be receiving news from a young Aquarian you men 45 years and older it could be your kids because they're coming up with the energy of the lovers okay some of you might want to connect with a, a Taurus um, I'm seeing help um, is coming in um, I'm seeing that at a Taurus, some of you want to reconnect with a Taurus, but whatever has transpired and whatever information came out, I'm seeing some of you, if you were in a relationship with a Virgo, this Virgo is turning their backs on you. So, um, the lies and the deceptiveness is coming out. So, um, whatever transpire at your work, because this is coming up as if it's at your work, um, Aries. I'm seeing um, some truths is coming out at your work, and I'm seeing, um, and especially you young Aries, I'm seeing whatever deceptiveness and lies about family member and that sort of a thing, it's coming out. Some of you, there are secrets, and some of you um, secretly in love with a scorpion. Some of you are secret in love with a scorpion. Whatever is happening and transpiring, a scorpion or you are secret in love with a scorpion. But there are secrets that is coming out and it has secret loves or it, there could be a secret love and it, is, it could be a scorpion, okay? So some of you could be secretly in love with a scorpion, but I'm seeing burdens uh, and whatever the burdens is uh, that is coming out for you guys, I'm seeing a lot of burdens that is coming up for you, um, Aries. So. I'm seeing situation in organization that is transpiring. Um, and for you young um, Aries, I'm seeing some lies and deceptiveness with either your, your husband or your wife. And there it is where um, it could be with a cancer because this cancer comes up and whatever the situation is, there is some lies and deceptiveness with a cancer and whatever is transpiring, Okay. So let's see what is coming up. Now, there is situation. Some of you are dealing with some institutes, organization. And um, I'm seeing 
they're seeing what exactly had transpired. Um, the energy that some of you have to pay back some money because they found out something and it has to do with you younger people and you older men, 45 years and older. Okay. Younger people and older men, 45 years and older. Um, then we see that you older men, 45 years and older want to reconnect, um, with a soulmate or a twin flame, or this person could be someone who you have known in past lifetime, but this person do not want to work with you. So don't even try because this person do not want to connect with you for whatever reason. There is just a lot of secrets that you have and deceptiveness and lies. And it could be your wife that is deciding to leave you. You men, um, or hoping for an, an end to the situation, you have created the situation yourself, you men. So you men 45 years and older have created a situation. I'm seeing you receiving news from an Aquarian, but you're burdened down. So it could be a child that a news is coming in, but you're so burdened down that, you know, whatever is to inspire, you're not open to this because you're burdened down with your own issues for you men 45 years and older. I'm seeing someone who is an Aquarian and so because you're worried about an Aquarian. And this Aquarian is a young person that is saying exactly because they're speaking up about something that has happened and has transpired. Let's see what the angels of Atlantis is saying. Now, the angels of Atlantis, um, Archangel Shamuel, a new beginning could be coming in for some of you. Um, and this is a, a, some of you young um, people who want new love. I'm seeing um, an offer of love is coming in, a new beginning is coming in. I'm seeing if some of you have a mother that is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, I'm seeing a new, new beginning coming in for this person. So if you are married um, or your mom is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, I'm seeing a new beginning is coming in for this person. Home. I trust and follow my divine guidance about my home. I trust and follow my dis divine guidance about my home. So this could be something that there is information that is coming in about your home or whatever that is transpiring. And you're going to be trusting the divine guidance that you're receiving. So if you receive, so it says you need to clear your house or something is transpiring in your house, you need to remove whatever lower negative energies that is in there. Some of you, um, um, could be um, saying, okay, um, um, that someone wants to move in with you and your, ch and you know, it could be that you guys uh, decide on a home, and you know, some of you are going to go home to your family also. Whatever is transpiring, I'm seeing some of you coming home to your family. Now, whatever is happening, Aries, I'm seeing the end is coming into a situation. Um, you, Aries, man, whatever is transpiring. I'm seeing the end coming into a situation at home for you, Aries man. Okay. And whatever the issue and situation is uh, with a home or you could be divorcing. So I see this also coming out. So um, each and every person have different energy vibration and vibrate of a different energy vibration time. So it will, um, there will be um, a difference of energy that is coming in. Okay. Um, ladies and gentlemen, please like, share these videos and I'm saying namaste until next time.